Hello and welcome back to On The Workbench. Today we're taking a look at a product from Husky. This is a screwdriver magnetizer demagnetizer that I picked up from the Home Depot not that long ago. This is an all-in-one tool uh, where the magnetizer and demagnetizer parts are all connected together so they don't separate. I used to have a set that I believe was a Craftsman pair that was held together by what looked like rubber bands and that's broken apart and just got obnoxious and has become basically worthless. So I picked this up as a replacement. Uh, this is made in China, just for full disclosure here. But one of my main things I liked about this was the fact that it was all in one. It does have a lifetime warranty on it. Uh, I suppose my Craftsman one still has a lifetime warranty on it. I'm not really sure that there's a good way to warranty that. I guess I could go to Lowe's and warranty it, but in any event, I picked this up because I like the idea of it being an all-in-one, and to me it just seemed like a better product idea. So when you get it out of the package here, you can feel it's like an ABS plastic with the magnets that are inside of it. Now, let me grab a screwdriver and some screws, and we'll see what this can do. All right, so I've got a screwdriver here, and I'm going to take the screwdriver, and I'm going to put this through the magnetizer. So definitely, I would make sure you don't have your phone nearby or anything else that would get in the way or could be magnetically damaged around this tool. All right, so put the screwdriver in that a couple times. Now here's a drywall bit. You see it picks it right up there. Put it on the tip. There we go. Holds it just fine. We've got a few other screws here that I picked up just for fun. It's the wrong size. That's a square head, but still does the job just fine. Picks it up. Even sort of picks up this concrete screw, this tap con. Now if we take the demagnetizer, I'm going to rub the screwdriver through it a couple times. Make sure I get that tip just right and try to demagnetize the tip. Hopefully that was enough passes. Now. I take this drywall screw here, we can see nothing, no attraction. Nothing happens. I'll put this back through the magnetizer side. There we go, there's that drywall screw. Here's one of these pocket hole screws here. Again, no problem. Just for fun, I've got another tray of screws. Now watch what happens here with this magnetized screwdriver. Absolutely nothing. So why is there absolutely nothing happening? Why is the screwdriver not picking up these screws even though the screwdriver is magnetized? Here's your answer. It's because they are stainless screws. Magnetization is never gonna work with stainless screws, by the way. So if you're working with stainless screws, say in an outdoor setting, this magnetizer tool will not do any magic tricks for you. You'll need to find other ways to secure your fasteners onto the end of your screwdrivers. And so there you go. You can see this little Husky tool works. And just very quick and simple, easy way to add some superpowers to a basic screwdriver. Questions or comments, put it down below. Like content like this, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Click the subscribe button if you haven't already done so. Thanks for watching and have a great day. Bye.